hello everybody diamond here welcome back to another video of mine and today um i have a smile on my face but i'm actually pretty upset about the things that have been happening over the past week if not more days so um before i jump into this video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe on this video and this video is solely for educational purposes only it's no hate or malicious intent to any of the people I'm mentioning today, but um, I'm just going to share with you guys my experience with Apple Care support while trying to move stuff from one hard drive to the other and how I ended up losing my entire iMovie library. This serves as, as an air of warning to you guys who use iMovie, um, most importantly to edit and, um, you know, our content creators like me, especially using like you know creating frequent content this serves an error once so let's just get into it so about a week ago i noticed that um i was actually editing a cooking video that was supposed to be uploaded you know uh days after my last video but um you'll figure out why it's not going to be uploaded in a while in a few minutes but so i was um working on editing and the way i edit is first i do like the rough chops and make sure everything is just flowing as i as i want it to and i cut off the excess and then um on like the second day or like the second editing session i go back in and i you know like tweak everything i add the music i add the captions the titles whatever okay so um I finished the first day of editing and on the second day of editing I pulled on my iMovie and to my surprise everything was gone everything was gone so my heart dropped I was like oh my gosh what do I do I tried to unplug and replug in my hard drive um, about two to three different times that didn't work so I was like okay let me call Apple support and over this whole over this three or four days that I was calling them back to back like every day in a row I was calling them and um I think we were on the phone maybe a total of about four hours or maybe five I was on the phone about an hour each time with each representative um trying to get my problem addressed so basically what happened what long story short what ended up happening was my hard drive ran out of space and so due to it running out of space in my iMovie library took up about 500 gigabytes so the 500 gigabytes plus it running low on space was causing a lot of problems for it and basically it was just like tweaking out and just couldn't do it so um you know everybody i talked to at apple support was helpful besides a few people um, which I'm probably going to get into later on, but you know, everybody was pretty much helpful. But the thing is, everybody was saying the same thing. And it's like, if it was that easy, I would just do it. Okay. So the first representative, he was helpful. I was trying to go from one to the other. So he was like, just highlight everything and go from one to another. And so this amount of space that I had on my files in my hard drive was about one terabyte of stuff so my computer could not handle doing that in one big transfer so I was like okay that's not working it's saying failed okay so I was like okay well let me just do the picture the video camera stuff and then I'm gonna do the iMovie stuff okay and so I did that that worked until it didn't um the problem with that ended up being my battery didn't have enough juice to, you know, transfer that much high volume in one time. It would take about 14 hours to do for, to go from one drive to the other. OK, so in 14 hours of, you know, my computer working, it went dead in the middle of it. And so I was back at square one. So then the third thing I did, um, I talked to another representative and she said, just go bit by bit by bit by bit. And that was very, that was too tedious for me to do. I could have done it, but it's very, it's just too tedious. Like, why would I do that and like do it, wait an hour? I don't have time like that. Okay. So that real, that solution wasn't really working for me. So I basically ended up kind of getting upset so I called Apple support again and she and I talked to a lady and you know she was a nice lady but it's kind of like she was a little condescending in the way she was talking to me and I was already frustrated so you know so I already purchased the new hard drive which I did I got one that was about four terabytes as per the first consultant told me and so um 
I purchased the new hard drive that was 4 terabytes, so I was trying to get everything onto there. So I already purchased that. That was about $89. I, I went to Walmart and purchased that the next day. I tried to get back in contact with the dude who told me to purchase it. He didn't respond to my emails. Anyways, neither here nor there. Somebody else was able to help me. So I got the hard drive, right? So I was telling the lady, you know, I can't really do do large volume transfers like that because my computer is going to run out of juice because I only have two USB A ports. So if one is from the old one is one is for the new one, I have no port to plug in my charger. This lady suggests for me to buy another thing for my computer. Mind you guys, I have I just just bought this new thing and I had to purchase this hub connector to go from USB whatever it is to USB A I guess so I just purchased that and it's just like okay more stuff I have to purchase great so I was like you know I'm really not trying to purchase that right now is there anything else that can be done in terms of that and she basically told me no so um she basically told me no and then I was on the phone with one other person the last time I think I dealt with it Friday that was like my last straw with it I was just kind of like okay is there anything like last ditch effort that we can do so we tried to load up iMovie it was loading 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 and didn't do anything um and so you know but my iMovie library the file was still 400 something gigabytes so at the end of the day, so I tried to do it and I got it to load up. Then it said zero out of 72 product projects are can be loaded or found or something like that. And I was just like, oh my God. Like at this point, I just wasn't even upset because I was just like, I'm so done with this. I'm so done with iMovie. Like this is absolutely crazy. But like it really wasn't iMovie's fault. It really was my fault for creating everything in this one huge library and not really having sufficient enough space to back that and you know not deleting like old stuff and all of that but that's basically how I ended up losing my whole iMovie um my whole iMovie, iMovie library and including old videos that are already on YouTube so I'm thankful for that and one video that ended up going unpublished and it was a Red Beans and Rice video y'all it was going to be so good I'm gonna try to see if I can recover some footage to try to get it up I don't know but um i'm going to insert some clips of a phone call that i got just to, this is just one phone call a few minutes of one phone call and just to see like they're not talking to me crazy but it's just like some of the things that they suggest and or say just really had me up if you're saying the man doesn't have enough power or battery what's the reason um like it charges to full capacity but from going from one hard drive to another, transferring the stuff, it says it'll take about 14 hours or 8 hours. And, you know, I'll go through with it and then it'll just die because, you know, it takes so long. And, it, it, and it's like, you know, like my Mac just, like, won't go through all of that. And I put my brightness on, power saving mode, and it just it just can't come, ha handle it, I guess. Gotcha. Now, forgive me for asking, though, but why isn't it? Uh, this, it is highly recommended to do this with the power adapter connected so that way it's not running on battery yes sir i understand but i only have two usb a ports and i if i have two hard drives plugged in where would i put the power adapter and i don't gotcha. have an extension so i just a, have two yeah, yeah i don't have a hub at the moment okay all right so um so yeah, you guys, that's how I ended up losing my all of my files and all of my iMovie. And I'm trying, like, I know that this is, like, kind of like a divine delay. And, like, I was already thinking about, you know, going on to a different um, interface to do my editing on. So this is just, you know, I guess the push I needed but didn't want to go ahead and go on and um, learn a new um, editing software. So... But um, long story short, this is just like a, a I guess, an update video or a where I've been video because I really try my best to be consistent. And then another thing is school has just started back for the spring semester. I'm not taking that many hours, but, you know, it does take up a lot more time than I had whenever I was on break. But um, I'm still going to try to get the content out there for you guys. Like, you know, I'm in it to win it. And um, 
yeah, that's basically what happened, y'all. I'm just kind of like down about it, but I'm not gonna let I'm not gonna let you know something like that deter me or discourage me or stop me from you know the greatness. So I'm just gonna keep going and keep at it and you know trying to get these videos up at least once a week, at least once every two weeks. But I think I, I could do once a week. Um, so yeah, you guys, that's basically. That's basically where I'm at right now. So thank you guys for tuning in and watching this video today. Um, don't forget to subscribe. And thank you guys so much for 150 subscribers. I noticed I was at 150 subscribers um, after I looked at my YouTube. And I saw that um, most of my videos were on there. And then I saw, oh my god, I hit 150. So thank you guys so, 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 so much for 150 subscribers. It means a lot to me. And, you know, let's keep growing together. And, you know, I'm excited to see what's in the future. Thank you guys for all of the support and the love. And thanks for watching this video. And I'll see you guys in the next. Bye, you guys.